So today I'm going to be creating this burnt winged out eye look. First I'm going to start by carving out my eyebrow and then applying it all over my eyelid to start out with a tacky base for the shadows. Once the base is all applied to my eyelid and I'm happy with how covered it is, I will then move on to my eyeshadows. Using the Jaclyn Hill palette, Ring the Alarm, I'm going to take the shade Framed and start by creating my shape. I'm happy with my shape I'm then going to take the shade Rush in the palette and blend out that first colour. And then you take the shade framed again and just blend them lines together smoothly. And then I'm going to take the Pina Louise base in the shade number 2 and start cutting my crease. So I've cut my crease, I'm then going to take the shade Framed again and I'm going to blend that outer corner so there's no harsh lines from the eyeshadow in the cut crease. I'm 
then going to take the shade brush and blend the first colour out so there's no harsh lines. I'm then going to take the shade White Lies in Bare Necessity from the EYN palette and I'm going to blend that on the very last part of my cut crease. Once they're all blended together and I'm happy with it, I'm then going to go in with my glitter. I'm going to use a glitter pen dipped in a loose glitter and apply that to the edge of my cut crease. Once I'm happy with the glitter, I'm going to move on to the eyeliner. Notice that I've got a wonky septum. I'm going to take the eyeliner to the top of my lash line. a black eyeliner pencil to both my top and bottom water lines. Once I've applied mascara in my false lashes, I'm then going to take the shade Framed and apply that to the bottom of my lash line, blending that out with brush. I'm now going to move on to my foundation using the Wet n Wild Photo Focus in the shade Nude Ivory. I'm going to take a stipple brush and blend that all the way through my skin, fully blended out using a beauty blender.
then going to take the collection powder and blend that all over my face to match my foundation. I will then add contour, bronzer, blush and highlight to finish off my base. Not sure why my camera keeps going out of focus and creating my face to be bright white, but yeah, it's getting quite annoying now. <laughs> onto my lips, lining them with the Barry M liner and applying the W7 Mega Matte Lips. Once that is done, that is the full look finished. I hope you have enjoyed and I'll see you in the next video.